Good morning, my beautiful friends. It's another day and I'm doing a what I eat in a day video. Today I'm taking you around a full day of eating. It's a weekday, so I'm all dressed and ready for work. I'm currently on the 21 day fix uh, workout program so I got my workout in this morning and I'm eating the I'm on my WW I've been on my WW since January 1st and I've been loving it so I've been on it for now um, eight months and it's been amazing I really love it I'm on the green plan I've stayed on the green plan the whole time and that's the one that I seem to really enjoy um, I might get more experiment I have honestly no desire to change what plan I'm on right now but um, maybe when I get to my goal weight or something like that I'll switch it up but um, until then I'm really enjoying the green plan and let's get started into the day I'm going to make my coffee and then I'm kind of on the fence about what I'm gonna have for breakfast I'm either gonna do light and fit yogurt with granola which is one of my favorites or I'm gonna do um, I have this lemon poppy seed bread that is left over from the weekend that I didn't eat and I really want to eat that too. I don't know. I don't know. I'll figure it out and I'll show you. <laughs> together and decided to make something savory because between my workout and I just didn't eat that much this weekend which is kind of odd for me but I did eat a lot during the week so I don't know anyway I woke up starving especially after my workout and I decided to make a yummy breakfast burrito which I haven't gotten to make in years because I'm gluten-free and it's really hard to find good gluten-free wraps but this is a nice giant like burrito wrap and it's super delicious. And I'm so sorry for my crazy chihuahua going crazy nuts in the background. I don't know if my neighbor's doing stairs or what, but like they're stomping up and down the stairs and it's driving Tucker nuts. So sorry guys. I'm having a mid morning snack. It's about 12 o'clock now. Um, I woke up really early. I woke up at 7 a.m but I didn't eat breakfast until later morning, but now I think because I waited so long, I'm starving. So I'm having the rest of that lemon poppy seed bread and a second cup of coffee. So that's what I'm ha uh, that's what I'll ha I'm having now. I'll show you the food and the point. Also, on top of the coffee, I have been hydrating a lot. I drink a bunch of these waters. I've had about three so far today, and I'm about to fill it up again to drink some more. Staying hydrated, especially in Texas summers, is so important and it's definitely a way to tell if you're really thirsty versus hungry. Um, I probably am more thirsty than hungry, but I think I'm gonna do both anyway. It's the late afternoon now and it's definitely lunchtime. I made myself a little salad with my barbecue chicken, my bolt house farm, ranch dressing, and some romaine lettuce, tomatoes, and a little bit of fat-free cheddar cheese. I'm so excited to eat it, and I'm extra hungry, so I'll show you what it looks like a little bit more clearly, and the points that they are. It's time for dinner, and I'm trying to figure out what I'm actually going to eat. I look through my fridge, I have some rice that is left over from another meal and um, the chicken sausage that's not cooked yet, like some uncooked chicken sausage, as well as some veggies. So I think I'm gonna just do a bowl of rice, 
chicken sausage, um, a bunch of veggies, a little bit of, I can't believe it's not butter light or reduced fat, something like that. It's like one point for a tablespoon and then some fat free cheddar cheese for zero points too. Um, because yeah, the thing I thought I was gonna make is just not sounding good to me right now. <laughs> bowl right here it is not that pretty but it's super yummy this is probably my most like not this actual meal but I pretty much do similar dinners this all the time just like throwing together whatever I have in my pantry I try to get creative with the items I have so I'm always using food that I have instead of buying new things and wasting food um, and yeah I love just throwing things together with you know some of my favorite items like fat-free cheddar cheese and um, some kind of a meat and veggies I'll do frozen veggies if I have it whatever veggies I have um, and then a starch of some kind so yeah that is my dinner I'm excited to eat it I'm feeling very faint right now I'm looking kind of rough I've been up since early and we didn't I went to bed like at 1 in the morning which is really really late for me and then I got up at seven, which is for some with Addison's disease or an autoimmune disease, having six hours of sleep is like crazy. I don't even know what I was thinking, but I did it. I'm living with it, but I'm getting really, really tired. So I'm going to eat this and I may go to bed really early or I might have dessert. Who knows? Um, I will let you know if I eat anything else. Otherwise, I'll be saying goodnight to you later. It's 9.15 at night and I'm definitely not hungry for anything else. If anything, I might make myself an unsweet iced tea with some lemon juice um, as like a refreshing drink because it's kind of hot even in my apartment. I think I'm going to turn my AC down. And um, yeah, so I'm totally done for the day. That's what I ate in a day. I ate 27 points on the green plan. I have three points left for the day and I am totally full and satisfied and that's what I love about the green plan. I also follow a gluten-free diet if I, I don't think I've mentioned that in the video earlier. I follow a gluten-free diet because I have celiac disease and if you wanna see more videos like this, please give this video a big old thumbs up and comment down below what you like, what you'd also like to see. I love making recipe videos on my WW. I make videos about my journey on my WW from start to now, as well as what I eat in a day videos. I also make some Catholic content because I'm Catholic and everyday lifestyle vlogs. So if you like more content, if you like this video, check out some of my other videos. I'd love to have you stick around and if you've been here, then thanks so much for keeping up with me and being my friend. Bye!